OK. Next phase of this video, we're going to do a Craviato two-in-one kit. Two-in-one kit means simply this. When we design this kit, we design it with a baseball bat edge on the top to give you some extra warmth and take some of the overtones out, but a 45-degree edge on the bottom to retain all the sensitivity and the resonance. Now, the concept behind the two-in-one design was to take and give you two kits for the price of one. So as a result, there's a Craviato two-in-one badge here that has the Craviato name right side up and upside down. And if you decide you want to take your kit out one night and use uh, everything with the warmer attack from the baseball bat batter side and then the uh, greater uh, projection and resonance from the 45, you use it that way. If you decide you want to change it around, you want to use a sharper attack with the 45 degree edge and warmer resonance with the baseball edge, you just flip the drum upside down. In this case, on the 8x12, on the 14x14, 14 14, the floor tom leg brackets are right in the middle, so all you do is flip the drum upside down and you're golden. On the bass drum, all you've got to do is flip the drum around, slide out the gull wing spurs that are mounted in the middle, and you're in business again. So you've got basically two kits for the price of one. And you can leave your bass drum. If you like the bass drum with the warmth of the batter side being the baseball bat, leave it as is. Just flip the toms. All sorts of different combinations. It's an 8x12, a 1414, and a small footprint 14x16 bass drum that we've got a little Gibraltar riser on there to give it a little extra lift. So what we're going to do here for you is give you this video in two segments of tuning. One being uh, uh, more of a, uh, well, call it a wide open, lower tuning, and then we're going to tune it up higher. So let's give you something with the uh, lower tuning, and we'll give you an example of how the sound differs. With those wood hoops that are on this kit, the wood hoops create a lighter, airier, more organic sound than you get with metal hoops. So we're going to give you a sample of this, and you'll see the difference. Not only is the sound different, but the drum is much lighter. So here we go. full sound. And we're going to put it all together with the rest of the kit, with the snare drum here to give you a sense. And then we're going to take a break. We're going to tune it up higher so you can see what it's like at a higher pitch tuning. So here we go. tuning. So we're going to take a break, tune it up higher, and let's see what it sounds like when we crank it up a bit. We've now tuned it up to uh, the times in the bass drum to a higher level, which is the range that I'm uh, most comfortable with for a small size kit like this. So we're going to give you a sample of it. Uh, you heard it with the low tuning, which is remarkable, and the solid shells give you a huge range. So here it is with higher tuning, and again, with the wood hoops, they're going to add a little bit lighter, airier sound to it. So here we go, higher tuning.
got is different animal with wood hoops. Totally different. Okay, let's put it all together on this kit. higher tuning. Difference in the sound, obviously. You can see this at the website at maxwelldrums.com. The kit's up there and we can order you one just like it in any kind of woods you like that Craviato makes. Thanks everybody.